Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make a smoke detector using Arduino. This project has an OLED display to show smoke and CO values. It is a very easy to build project, also a very useful thing to have. So without further ado, let's start this video. This video is sponsored by JLC PCB, which is one of the largest PCB manufacturing company of China. First, I have created schematic diagram of the project then I created PCB layout and then I generated Gerber files and upload them to JLC PCB website. Then I selected all required parameters such as dimension, quantity, color and a few more options. Then I click on save to cart. This will send our project into shopping cart. Then I click on checkout securely and then I add my shipping address and select my desired shipping and payment method. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. These are my other channels, do subscribe them as well. And you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Component list, circuit diagram, everything is in the description below. First, let's see how this project works. The sensor detects smoke and CO values and send it to Arduino. Arduino then process these values and display these values on the LCD display. Also check if these values are above safe level, then it send command to buzzer and buzzer starts alarming. Now let's make this circuit. These are all the components we are gonna need for this project. First, I'm gonna connect Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect a 2-pin terminal block and connect its one pin to ground and its other pin to 5-fold pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect the screen and connect its VCC pin to 5-fold pin of Arduino, its ground pin to ground, its SGA pin to A4 pin of Arduino and its SCL pin to A5 pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect the sensor and connect its VCC pin to 5-fold pin of Arduino, its ground pin to ground and its analog pin to A0 pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect an LED and connect its anode to D13 pin of Arduino and its cathode to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect BC547 transistor and connect its pin number 3 to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to D2 pin of Arduino and its other pin to pin number 2 of the transistor. After that, I'm gonna connect a buzzer and connect its positive pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino and its negative pin to pin number 1 of the transistor. After that, I'm gonna connect a push button and connect its one pin to D3 pin of Arduino and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect another push button and connect its one pin to D4 pin of Arduino and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect another push button and connect its one pin to D5 pin of Arduino and its other pin to ground. So I have done all the connections. Now let's upload the code to Arduino and test this project. So this is the Arduino code for the project. The code is using libraries. We need to include these libraries to our Arduino IDE. You can find these libraries in the project archive. You can download it from the link given in the description below. Now go to sketch and click on include library. Then select add library. Now select the library file and click open. Now click on upload button to upload the code to the Arduino.
so that's it for today's video i hope you have enjoyed this video for more videos like that stay tuned and i will see you in the next video